guys, it's the Ninja Nerd here. Today I'm here to talk about the new tease, two new Joker movies that uh, uh, Warner Brothers DC has planned. One of them is, is set in the DC universe and one of them isn't. The first one is the uh, the Martin Scorsese one. The, uh, the one that's going to be set in the 1980s and it's supposed to be a Joker origin movie. It's supposed to be like, like Taxi Driver and it's Martin Scorsese is supposed to produce it. Uh, Todd Phillips, I think that's the guy that's supposed to direct it, and I don't know, I'm just not big into, into the whole idea of a Joker movie, like it, a movie solely about the Joker, I just I just don't know if that could work, now, I, now a lot of people are excited because Martin Scorsese is producing it, keep in mind that producer can mean a lot of things, producer can mean, you know, you came in, helped Help, help get the writer, you help get the director, you help you know, get writers, help cast people, you help do a lot of stuff with the movie. But producer could also mean you just gave a couple of ideas, signed a check, and now you're producing. So producer can have a whole bunch of different meanings that we don't know about. I'm just curious about the Joker movie because I don't know if is Batman gonna be in it because Batman is such a essential part of his story. Yes, we don't know what the whole his whole Joker story, but because you know it's always changing. One minute he's a comedian, next he's a you know, the recent one he's like it's like three different versions of Joker. Like it's like then there's another one where he's like from it's different jokers from all type of time periods like it's just it just gets weirder and weirder but the one thing that really has stayed the same is that at one point he became red hood and batman knocked him into a full of pit of bat of acid and that's how he became the joker that's the only thing we know for sure happened so i'm very curious about this joker movie i, I don't know how i feel about it i'm kind of on hand i'm like okay Depending on how they do it, it could work, but I'm just on this hand, I'm just like, I just don't think a Joker, standalone Joker movie about just the Joker can work. Now, you have this movie that is set in the DCEU, it's called, we don't know what it's, what it's called yet, but I think it's tentatively called, called Mad Love, I like that title. New Joker, Harley Quinn, Mad Love, I like that title. And it's supposed to be about, you know, you know, clearly Joker and Harley Quinn, you know, Jared Leto's Joker and Margaret Robbie's uh, Harley Quinn. I'm one of the people, despite how little he was in the movie, I'm one of the people who really enjoyed Jared Leto's Joker. I thought he was a really good Joker. But I know a lot of people weren't too big on his Joker. I thought he was good for, for what he was in. And I was excited to see more of him. I think we also know that he's going to be in Suicide Squad 2. And Gotham City Sirens, and there's rumors that he might even be in the uh, Batman movie. So, I'm just, I'm, I actually do want to see this. I'm very, since it's not solely about the Joker and other characters from the DC are going to be in there. So, like, this could, it seems like it's going to be like sort of like a Bonnie and Clyde type of movie where, you know, Joker and Harley Quinn just going around committing crimes. I'm very curious to see a Joker and Harley Quinn twist on that. And one of the things people they did like about Suicide Squad was the Joker and Harley relationship. And I know they took a lot of stuff out of the movie because when Batman v Superman came out, they took a lot of stuff out of the movie that made that relationship more dark, like more how it is in the comics. But it is, in this movie, they made it more like it was more. In the comics, it's always been more of a one way thing where Harley's always kind of coming after Joker, Joker's kind of like leave me alone, but in this one it's kind of a two way thing they they have a very unhealthy obsession with each other like so it's kind of like so it's kind of a two way thing I, I kind of really like that but yeah, I'm really excited to see this new Joker movie, let me know what you guys think about it. This, these two Joker movies are you guys excited to see it either or or both of them or none of them at all so let me know what you guys think about this let, let me know what you guys think the about this in the comment section below do you guys think that these movies could work 
uh, hit that notification bell lets you know whenever I post a video and do me a favor leave a like it lets other people be able to see my content leave a like comment despite whatever you think about this video like comment and subscribe